to bring him up. Make him feel really welcome, you guys. Make a lot of noise for Dante Barnett. Woo! Yo, know, it's funny, my name's Dante, but it's spelled all fucked up. Um, it's D-U-A-N-T-E. Uh, that means I get everything from Duante to Dwayne to Dwayne, like there's not even a T in it. Uh, but the funny part is, the job interviews, people really have the balls to ask me if I have spelled my name right. <laughs> like I didn't graduate kindergarten this shit. Uh, the funny part was, I figured out my name was really killing my resume, because it's all ethnic and shit. I mean, I've got a master's degree, and the only jobs I could get calls for were like liquor store manager, uh, janitor, garbage man. Uh, funny part is, though, my name's Edward, my middle name, uh, so I started using that on my resume, and the calls got way better. Uh, I was getting calls for like IT analysts, management, banker, and shit. Uh, the problem was, when I went for the interview, they were expecting a Tyler, not a Tyro. <laughs> I know it's the holiday season, it's a lot of your favorite season, right? Clap it up, right? Yeah. I don't mean the holidays though, it's pumpkin spice latte season, right? Yeah? Any pumpkin spice latte fans? Uh, this time of year I usually get the same person come to my office, they'll be like, oh my god, I know you like pumpkin spice latte. And I have to remind them, I'm only halfway. <laughs> Anybody in here do their ancestry and me, their 23 and me, any of that? Uh, I did mine. It's really fucking with my personal identity. Uh, this whole time, I thought I was an angry black guy. Uh, come to find out, I'm 60% white. I guess that means I'm an angry black guy. An uh, angry white guy. <laughs> I guess I gotta vote Trump next election to get a bag of hat too, right? Uh, <laughs> well, I fight stereotypes. I actually used to teach IT. And the first day of class, my students would usually give me a hard time. They'd say shit like, you know, the floor has been swept, uh, the garbage has been taken out. Uh, but I found a way to get back at them. Uh, since I had a master's degree, I told all my white students to call me a master. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Dayton's a little different. Uh, now that I'm older, you know, everybody's on Tinder or OkCupid and shit. And uh, being black in this market, you know, it's kind of hard, because in five pictures, i got to decide if she'll date a Tyler or Tyrone. <laughs> and I tried dating a white girl for a while. Uh, that didn't really work out uh, with this attitude. If you can tell her once in a while, I need to be told, never relax. And uh, Becky's not making it through that sentence, if you know what I mean. <laughs> but uh, just a heads up, I'm starting to learn these open mics are kind of like speed dating. Uh, just to give you a heads up, we're going to spend about three to four minutes with every guy here. Uh, at least one or two of them are guaranteed to make you feel awkward or wear you out a little bit. And any guy you see up here, if you see him in real life, uh, you're going to act like you don't know him. <laughs> <laughs> My name's Dante Barnett. Let's get the show on a roll. Everybody clap it up. Woo! If I remember correctly, give it up for Paul Curry, your first comedian. Woo!